This is Cameron Chai bringing you another episode of Azo TV and today I'm speaking to Jim Zobel from KLA 10 Corp and he's going to tell us about their Micro Exam 100. Hello. Uh, today we're going to look at the KLA 10 Corp Micro Exam 100. This is our white light interferometer. We're using uh, Moreau objectives which have the reference mirror internal of the objective and it also operates with a Michelson objective. We're basically use, reflecting the light off of the surface and off a reference mirror inside of the objective and we're looking at the change in the op optical path difference to make our measurements. The beams recombine and create what we call a fringe pattern. This is a manual uh, focus, manual tip tilt and a motorized XY stage. We have a very user-friendly interface to operate the tool. Here's our live camera view and you can see the fringe interference fringes here. We select what objective we are going to use that will tell us our XY dimensions. Our Z range, we can go from a smoother texture which is phase shift or scanning white light. So we go to a very high resolution scan to up to 250 microns. Select our image. And we get our data. So it's a very quick, quick uh, data acquisition. And once we have this data, we can then get different uh, types of data. We can get our RA, roughness values, step heights, and so on. We can also produce a 3D data. <clears throat> and a number of other uh, calculations can be done. So Jim, what's the maximum size sample the Micro Exam 100 can deal with? Uh, we can get, uh, it's a very open um, framework, so you can actually put a sample in that's uh, quite long actually, so it's re only restricted by this area. And what's the maximum XY travel of the, the sample stage? It's 4 inch by 4 inch. Alright, and if anybody wants more information about the Micro Exam 100, they can find that on your website? That's correct. It's www.kla10core.com. Alright Jim, thanks very much for taking a few minutes to tell us about the Micro Exam 100. Okay, thank you.